Her death, along with the death of actress Regina King's son, they're sparking conversations about mental health and the importance of getting the help you need. Reporter Jacinta Render spoke with a mother who lost her daughter to suicide and a counselor who calls it a crisis. Two recent deaths make national headlines. On Sunday, the New York Police Department reported the death of Chesley Christ, Miss USA 2019, and extra TV correspondent. Just last week, award-winning actress Regina King's son, Ian Alexander Jr., passed away. Both are believed to be suicides. One of the first things to remember is that um, Suicide affects everybody, um, all ages, all demographics, all income levels. The National Alliance on Mental Illness reports across the U.S. Suicide is the second leading cause of death in people ages 10 to 34. Julius Jeffries, a licensed counselor in Tennessee, says it is an ongoing issue that needs constant attention. So it's something that's really prevalent, just not a lot of people talk about it because not a lot of people are comfortable talking about suicide. It is a national and local crisis that impacts families. Monica Gufon, who lives in Knoxville, knows firsthand what it is like. In 2019, her daughter Sasha McAveen died by suicide her freshman year of college. Yeah, and everyone was just so shocked and it it was just so um, sudden and um, no one was prepared for it. If you're human, you're subject to mental health needs. In Knoxville, I'm Jacinta Render. If you or someone you know needs help, you can call the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline at the number on your screen. It's 1-800-273-8255. It is available 24-7.